First of all, it's been a fantastic year for the Rhinos and myself. A um, few accolades along the way. I can look back on it uh, you know, in you know, 20, 30, 40 years' time and be really proud of what I've achieved. Where have you come from and, and where, where are you right now that's enabled you to be the best player in, in our competition? Some of the things that I possibly could have done two or three years ago, um, I knocked that on the head and you know, pushed that aside and said, look, I've got my rugby to concentrate on them. You know, a few meetings with people at the club and you know, senior players who's, who's had, had a few words with me. Best I've seen that, outstanding. Hey, they're the extra efforts, aren't they? Start of the year, you, you struggled a little bit, didn't you? Yeah, definitely. I was in Max's office the first four or five weeks after every game about my positioning, where I should be, where I shouldn't be. I would argue with him. He thought he was right, I thought I was right. And um, there was just one game where I looked back after and thought, wow, I've, I've played a blinder there. And, and it was just confidence. It is as classic a try as you will see. Coming off the back of a great year, going into this test series is, is, is a massive opportunity for you. Although I've had a good year this year, I want to achieve more and hopefully I can do that with England, but I've only got two caps, so, um, you know, to, to pull on the jersey again and, you know, to play against the number one team in New Zealand, it'll be 110% uh, concentration and giving it my very best.